Okay, boom viewers, welcome back to the channel. Subscribers, you already know the thing set. We're blessed. Hope you had a wonderful day today, but you know my style. One bugger bugger, no one I gotta continue giving daily updates on the people you see and don't see on the screen. That's why it's extremely important to watch it and you don't miss a thing. And with that being said, I finally, <laughs> right, has just confirmed uh, what um, some people was thinking for the past few days. You see, my say, obviously, Homegirls got the bosoms done, you see me? And, you know, we won't know what it look like until everything, you know, is, is healed. You see, man, so many people put in the comment section, what do you think about that? Now, I know a lot of people said, you know, she might be pregnant and all of this stuff, so she's doing that. I don't know. People are not going to have to ask her um, about that. But let's just talk about the work that has been done. Because, as you can see, Ivani has always been that girl. You know what I mean? Very beautiful girl, you see what I'm saying? If she feels the need to enhance um, her looks to make her feel better, I'm alright with that. You see what I'm saying? I'm going to put that in the comment section where I think about that. You see me? Also, I know the people up in that business, you know them I'm saying? The Caribbean duo. <laughs> the Caribbean duo, you know, the Caribbean baddies, queen... Uh, yeah, I mean, why, why people just cuss out Boju Bantam, so you know, but we'll deal with that on the next video, you know, is it? Anyway, back to the argument, you know. Cheese and Ivan, they are Miami, um, getting the good work done in America, you see, my answer. Um, that, you know, Cheese, I think she has, you know, gotten her butt done um, previously, you see, my answer. I'm not sure about her, but I don't know, you know, my people, not just the messenger, but you know, these are both my girls, so. Anything they want to do, we are co-signed it, you see me. You know what I mean? So, that's again an update where I go on, flat go on. Um, as soon as them things, them heal up and then post the picture, we'll be sure to show it to you, you see me. And now people don't get mad at me for thinking what I'm thinking about Miss Kitty because me think she had true words by Ivan, you know. You know what I mean? Um, you know, Miss Kitty likes to prey on you know, the low lives, as they like to call people in society. You see what I say? So it wouldn't be far from the norm. As you know, Miss Kitty does have a baby, and the people them is really, you know, giving her a hard time. You see what I say? So this part don't have nothing to do with Ivani, and just, you know what I mean, just falls into place. Because, you know, Miss Kitty, I talk about the child father has to be, you know, in the child's life and all of this stuff. And I talk about people's mothers not being married, and most importantly, she's talking about her child not being a bastard because she was engaged while pregnant. I don't know if she was pregnant before engaged, uh, but I think they saved face uh, by marriaging so they wouldn't have a bastard picnic because, you know, she likes to talk to her get a girl who loose and a uh, four, five, six baby father and all them things and all do nothing for themselves. And she opened a high class society and you know, she no wedding, no marriage, no nothing, you see me? So I think she's having stress and postpartum and taking her anger out. And, you know, I don't want to say the low lives of society, but, you know, it is what it is, you see me? Let's take a listen. Don't let anybody force you or berate you or pressure you into certain things. I don't want the man them to know to say, a father is very important in the lives of their, to take care of him partner when she's pregnant, to be there for her, to attend to her, to love her, because when he loves her, that will tr trickle down and translate to the baby. I want the man them to understand, say, listen, you can't treat a baby mother bad. And even if you're a woman left, you're the pity them not left. You have to take care of your youth them. So that when graduation time comes around, you don't feel awkward and feel cute because you never did mind your youth them. Children deserve the best. The best don't necessarily mean material either. Let me get that straight. Right? So some people have say, um, my mother have eight of them will turn out fine. Kudos to your mom. Big up to your mother. But please also understand that having eight children in 1960 and eight children in 1970 and 1980 and even 1990 is different from having eight children Part I'm one. 41 and go through my pregnancy or me go through my pregnancy I just do and everything good for eat good for talk I just do everything and everything good for eat good for talk because if I say um, the treatment alone when I get during my pregnancy but I want pregnant I'll tend to my pregnant from my elbow I want pregnant every day because the way the treatment I get normal, normally a good treatment Pregnant treatment, 
You know, not showing the ear harp. <laughs> Your mother breed for four different men. None of the four man them never married cheats. Cut out, sir. How come she not married? You know, ask your mother that. Your mother abandoned you. Thank you, darling. Uh, your mother abandoned you when you're born. Why you not go ask her about that? Go ask her about that. Why she do it? Why not go ask her about that? So I am happy and proud to have been impregnated at 41 years old. My mommy, mother and mommy diaries on my YouTube channel. And I will repeat it here. I was engaged when I got pregnant. Engaged? Me never come, come say nothing about the engagement because the way I'm afraid of no mouth and the way I'm afraid of people, me never want to jinx it. Next thing, because me know of people who the man engage them and all five years them still engage. So me never really want to jinx it because me I say, Lord God, me never want to come out come talk about engagement and then you know, go through and then they go laugh and then they go talk. So I say, you know what is true? When it is permanent, I will speak. When it is permanent, I will speak the way my friend I all need go and the mouth. When it is permanent, I will speak. Because I know woman, oh when the man engage her, the man just say, eh, um, like how you behave now, all this. And I fight, and about, what, well, about eight years now, I know we didn't go on. Right? So you can't use, oh. Yeah, put in the comment section what you think about that. Like I said, I like Miss Kitty, you know, educated black, non-bleaching woman, you know what I mean? Which is rare in Jamaica these days, you know. Uh, but I feel she has a bit of insecurity with her features, being that she's amongst, you know, the white people that she's trying to please. Let's keep it up, Buck, you see what I said? Uh, I'm not sure why she's coming on TikTok every day. I'm going back and forth with these type of people because there's many other people out there which can talk to and don't have to, you know, be drawn out in these type of likes because she's far from perfect. Like I said, we don't know if she had been pregnant before she gets engaged since she learned to clarify things. You see what I said? Because she's trying to avoid that she's, you know, having a bastard child like the rest of these people out here. So you see me. And let's not forget she had body enhancement, whether it's fat transfer or whatnot. You see what I say? And then she had a knockout on your knee curvy deeper, Nikki Cromers, Mystical Menace. You see what I say? So, you know, I mean, I know the TikTok coins is beneficial to her. Um, but I think she just needs to come on social media and address different topics. You see what I say? Because let's keep it honest, people. When people like Miss Kitty and Meek Mill, they wrongs them. Them white virgins, them that control the system, them always come out in the public on their platform to make it look like black people is the problem. But we all know who controls the system, right? <laughs> so why don't they tell them white friends to tell them white family to free up the system for black people? Yeah. No, me just have to diss up Bojo Bantan idiot son because him upset that they dally them that's calling his daddy big buddy is questioning me and asking me who are these women kissing him obviously them not business if it's his daughter because they don't know all of him pitney they say my answer so i'm after deal with him wickedly and him sister so i gotta address them i'm a boom bye bye news channel you see my answer i'm not trying to subscribe and hit the notification bell to be notified whenever i do drop the latest and the dance on news musical views and gossips please